Hey lovelies, it's your girl Casual Chrissy. You're probably gonna hear my son oh. in the background because <laughs> he's sitting next to me. But so I woke up like just oh, geez, <laughs> Okay, I think you're right, it's gonna talk the most video, but you know what? That's mom life, and let's get to the video. So I woke up and I was just feeling I don't know, I just wasn't in the mood for anything. Oh. And I started watching some YouTube videos and I had to watch my girl Jeffree Star and Jeffree Star and Nicki no. Tutorials. <laughs> You're not gonna let me talk. Jeffree Star and Nicki Tutorials did, um, they were inspired by um, another YouTuber. I'm probably gonna say her name wrong. Myra? I think it's Myra. So she did this all highlighter makeup look using only highlighters to um, oh, no. literally do a full face of makeup. So they, they created this full face highlighting challenge. So I thought challenge accepted, we're gonna do this. Plus um, there's not that many out and I didn't see too many brown girls doing this. So no, I saw two and I thought oh. theirs was actually pretty. So this is not, let me make this disclaimer. This is not intended to be an everyday makeup look, but if you want to do you, boo, do you. I love highlighting. Um, the more I use them, the more I love them. And I thought, I'm going to do this challenge, but not only am I going to do the um, illuminating challenge, all the challenges I've seen, people use high-end makeup. So I was like, I'm going to switch it up a little bit and use drugstore. I am going to, uh, for my foundation, I am going to use the True Match Lumi Liquid Glow Illuminator, the primer highlight, but today we're going to use it as my foundation in the color W101 Golden Dore. So I'm going to start off using that. I'm going to try to use all drugstore or like TJ Maxx brand brushes too. So I'm going to use my e.l.f. I think this is called the Ultimate Blending Brush. Um, and just... All right. Oh my gosh, my son is going to be talking through half of this video. Because, you know, it's mom life yeah. and sometimes you have to record with your son in the room. So <laughs> on the more serious note, this actually can be used as a primer before your foundation if you want that luminous look and you don't have a luminous foundation and you don't necessarily want to go and buy one now i'm putting a little extra on some of my darker areas because i didn't use a like a real color corrector or primer or anything so i'm just going and i'm not using any real concealer so i'm just trying to make sure i am highlighting all the way i'm gonna look like you know what i just thought of uh in the wiz the original version of the wiz with um is it the lion that just face just looks so gold yeah because the lion oh my gosh okay so for my bronzer i'm going to use the wet and wild to reflect shimmer palette in the color sangria castles so this i'm going to use as my bronzer slash contour um can we get some color paint off here come on You know what, girl? I'm gonna set your face first. So to set my face, I am using the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Illuminating Palette. Um, does this have a different color? I think this is only one. Okay, so I think this is the only one. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but I'm actually gonna use this to set my face. Girl, where is your powder brush? Okay, here we go. I just okay. Oh no, that's bare minerals. We're just using. I am going yeah, to use a please. BH Cosmetics um flat top cookie. Yeah. You try to drink my water. Oh. Hold on, he wants mm, water. No. Okay. Yeah. I didn't think so. Because oh, yeah. she don't want water. Let's All right, so I'm just gonna set my face I with this because we want that highlight to I be set. You. And this is actually gonna give me. Uh, it's actually giving me a little pinky glow. Which, that's okay. Ooh, this is making me real pink. Okay, I was gonna, actually, okay. 
We'll just go like this. Let's blush it out. We wasn't doing that, but I'm taking actually this more pinky side to give me my blush right now. Wasn't planning on doing that, but we doing it. I'm lighting up the center a little bit. I'm just using my finger and grabbing the lightest shade to just kind of highlight right here. Down the nose. Okay, to take this bronze up a notch, I'm actually gonna use the e.l.f. Golden Bronzer. I know technically they call it a bronzer, but if you look at this, this is a highlighter. In nobody's world, at least not for any black woman, is this a real bronzer. So we're just gonna take that. To add some more golden, I got a little heavy with that pink. So I just wanna bring some more golden back. So this highlighter, look, there it is, girl, yeah. <sighs> we're gonna do it. Okay, so to highlight, I am going to use Precious Petals Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder um, in the color Precious Petals. And I'm going to use the Polish Fan Brush. I actually mentioned this in my May Favorites. If you didn't see that, if you don't with this video, go check that out. And we're just going to take a little bit because, you know, we got a highlight. Yes. Y'all see that? When you can highlight on the highlight. Uh-huh. There it is. Mm. Okay. Please. Okay, so I'm going into my Physicians Formula. Oh, whoa. Physicians Formula Warm Nude Palette. Um, this is a shimmer palette. I'm gonna take the darkest shade in the corner. So moving on to eyes, and this is gonna be my transition. Okay. Okay, golden guys. So I'm staying in this. I'm basically gonna use this whole thing for my eyes. Who do I want to do next? I'm gonna take you see, this like middle brick right here. We're gonna do this all over the lid. I'm gonna top this with a lighter color. Okay. I feel like it needs to be. So I'm gonna go and just kind of get these lighter ones to just, cause she's looking a little, there we go. Yep. We just need to highlight that out more. This is really fun. Oh my God. I think this is so cute. I'm gonna take that lighter shade. I'm just using the same brush. So to highlight that brow though. <laughs> so I'm just going in the whitest shade in the palette. To highlight that. Okay. Okay, moms, am I the only one that you literally have to have a toy everywhere? Like, I probably, it's gotten to the point where I think my son think my purse is his toy bag because Lord knows my child can't act. Oop! I'm gonna take this e.l.f. stippling brush. I'm gonna use these, like, lighter colors to try to highlight under my eyes because I feel like, there we go. I feel like my eye was looking a little dark right there. Yes. Woo! All right. All right. I'm gonna go in the other physician's formula, the natural nude. I'm gonna see how this darker color 
I'm going to use this BH, 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 <laughs> BH Cosmetics um, brush to give a more just. Oh, no. Oh, no. Can I do okay. anything? Maybe not. Oh. Yeah, it did. Okay. I did see a lot of people doing mad lips, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna use, what am I gonna use? Hmm. We're gonna do a metallic lip um, to go with this highlighted look. So first I'm gonna start off with the more Milani More Metallics Lip Cream in the color Automatic Touch. Um, side note, is it Automatic Touch? Yeah, Automatic Touch. I am going to do a review on these colors. I haven't gotten them all yet, which we're not even going to get into because the brown one would look so good with this look, but we're just going to work with it. Okay, so while waiting on that layer to dry, I'm going to put on my eyelashes. I'm going to warn you, I may cut that out of me putting them on because... <laughs> putting lashes on okay so i'm back with the lashes y'all it was a struggle i'm using some newer lashes that are just extra glam and um they're the ardell double up in the um style 202 no. um i think they're gorgeous lashes the only thing is they're stiff so they're like crazy hard and i feel like i know i'm like not perfect right in here so i'm just gonna take my elf liquid eyeliner and just clean it up a little bit because we're just gonna hide the little mistake we're gonna hide that i'm not perfect i'm not uh, my intention was not really to do an eyeliner but we gotta make it we gotta make it work we gotta make it work normally i would have lined my eyes before putting lashes on but I was trying to be faithful and not use the eyeliner, but I, I got to clean it up a little bit. Put, just kind of blend this a little bit because I forgot to put um, a little mascara on my real lashes. So we're just going to do that a little bit. I feel like this one lash, is, this one right here was giving me the worst problems. I feel like it's going to fall off. <sighs> do not miss me up. So just to make this just a little bit more metallic because... This, even though this shade is in the metallic series, it just wasn't metallic enough. So from the same Milani line, the More Metallics or More Metallics, I don't know. I'm gonna use Chromatic Attic. Now this is one, um, just really quickly about the lip gloss. I just feel like I cannot do by itself. I feel like it only looks good on, I've seen a few reviews of like Fair Girls where it just looks so gorgeous, but for me, girl, no. So we're just gonna I'm gonna take a makeup brush to kind of fix this a little bit just to blend it before it dries because it does dry very quickly. I'm just gonna blend it out. This really isn't a blender brush, but it was just what was in front of me because this dries pretty quickly. So, and it dries matte. Um, so, this is not a gloss. Okay, let's take the hair down. 